I bust your head. Rolling down, niggas really get it in this shit. Bitch, a nigga really get in all that bread. All this shit, trap a holly, boy, I get it there. Oh, I'm really getting stay. Sup? Go. Fear really has no limit. So when you think you've found your absolute worst fear, understand that there's always something worse. Number 17. All right, guys. I'm going to show you one of the reasons we hate this house. There's a YouTuber named Not Your Average Wife who apparently does not live in your average home either. Her dog, Catherine, absolutely refuses to go down the steps. Woo! You know it's a problem. You know something is on the assassin up when your dog don't want to go like in a, in, a, in a specific part of the house. Jesus, you got to get the hell out of there. And then you just said like you hate this house. If you hate it so much, get your money up, make that money, and then move out. Six miles out away from the house and more. Just saying. Stop playing these games before somebody get clocked up. Jesus. If your dog don't want to... Your dog is your biggest sign for anything paranormal. To their basement, follow the dog's eyes because I think it might be seeing something yeah. down there that none of us can. Yeah. Catherine, come on, baby. Come on, pretty. It's the whole jump right next to her. Even a nudge from behind can convince Catherine to go down the stairs. Come on, Catherine. And just to prove it's not a general fear of steps, they show her using different stairs without a problem. Maybe the dog almost fell down basement steps or something and is now afraid of them. Wow. At least that's the only non-paranormal explanation I can think of. And if it is paranormal, based on how Catherine is acting, it must be something sinister in that basement. Number 16. A live streamer named Spetsnaz Boss suspects his house could be haunted. After catching this moment on his channel, he is fully engrossed in the game when the clothing on his door lifts up for no reason at all. This looks not good. Please, I don't want to go. Please. The sleeve of his jacket raises in the air, as if to say hi to all of his fans watching. Hell no! There could be a chance this is staged, especially considering he is coincidentally playing a scary horror game. But maybe his fear is precisely what attracted it. Number 15. A fox with clouded over white eyes bites at the door, its tongue extending wildly, its teeth making a terrible scraping noise across the glass. <coughs> This you guys are clucked because the glass that he's on, I'm sorry to say, but it's not Adidas glass. It's not. Why is my jump just sticking there, bro? No. Uh, uh. You better hope whatever he's biting, like whatever he's biting on is locked. Oh, and I also thought about where did our wolf come from? That lets me know that you you all moved in a place next to like that. Whatever. I don't even think that's a wolf. I mean, it probably is, but it's like, I don't, that looks like a, I don't, hmm. who decided to move in that area where wolves are just very close? Who decided that? Because cluck that person and cluck, put that, throw that person outside the, outside the house. Let the wolf take care of that. Appears to have lost its mind, probably from rabies. Ew. There's no idea where it's going or what it's looking at, only that it wants to get inside and cause chaos. Look into its eyes, and you'll see all instinct is lost. <laughs> <and it's laughs> the madness and confusion. Oh my god! 
Oh, 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 it's time to oh, 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 God. moisture that isn't there, smearing its sickness into the glass. When it opens its mouth at 58 seconds, you can see the points of all of its teeth are gone, probably broken off from biting many hard surfaces as it stumbles through its final hour. It's crazy. Number Look, it was. This video very quickly turns into one of the worst fears that I think most that... people have. Your parents walking in on you doing something embarrassing. This is believed to be a Twitch streamer from Russia, but I was unable to track down who this streamer is. If you know, let me know in the comments. But anyways, she's in the middle of lip syncing a Japanese song for the viewers watching her Twitch stream. Oh god. That's when she hears her door opening. She quickly jumps to turn the music off. Clearly embarrassed, he's just walked into her stream. Apparently, this is her stepdad, and they have a short conversation before she starts closing the door on him. It's always been a fear of mine to get walked in on while singing along to my favorite songs, but I can only imagine how worse it would be to have it happen while in a cosplay of- Oh! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Holy hoes, that's weird! But way before the stepdad came in, I got my, oh, I just got creeped out. Oh my God. Because she looks like, she looks young as hell. Like she looks about 13, 14, if that. Bro, she looks like a kid, kid. With mad sus dolls. But forget about that. Why do you? Oh my God! You're you're a kid, kid. I don't think you should be on. What did he say? Twitch, or he said something with a T. He just said it. What is it called? Oh God. Um. What is it? What is it? Uh. <sighs> all all of these sus kids are like on it nowadays. What is it? What is it called? What is it called? What is it called? What's it called? It's, uh, not not Twitch. It starts with a T. He just said it. Top? No, I'm about to say Tumblr. Wow. No. Ten? No, not Tinder. Wow. Jesus. Uh. I know what he said. I just, you know what he, y'all know what he said. I just can't say what he just said at the moment. But she shouldn't, she should have no business being on that. She's a kid, kid. And if she's not a kid, kid, and she's a full grown woman, wow, that's disturbing. She looks really young. So that's a problem in itself. And then you got your stepdad and nothing but draws. Coming in your door, unannounced, no knock, no no nothing, just open the door. Just He kind of looked like he was ready to do some things with you. I'm not even going to lie. Your dad, your stepdad looks, he looks a little sus. Look, he looked like he did some sus things in his past. And it kind of doesn't help that, the, that her mom or like the wife or the whatever is not also in the video. So to me, it looks like she just lives with her stepdad. Oh my God. And it kind of looks like he was looking at her. So it's just this whole, this whole video right here. It's just the definition of sus. Oh my God. This was kind of hard to look. This was kind of hard to look at. I'm not even going to lie with you. I'm not even capping. <laughs> oh shit. Mm mm mm. He ain't nothing but draws. Come on, bro. Fit in live streaming. It might be time to look. A lock. Look. Number three. You saw the way he was looking at her. A dog barks in the distance at an alleged ghost seen floating around a woman's college in Asansol, India. <laughs> You got it. You got it, nah. Oh.
It kind of looks like they are floating in midair at first, but I think they are probably walking across a rather thin branch. I think I see them grab onto the tree for support at 6 seconds into the video, so I can't agree for certain that this is an actual ghost. Number 12, a British music store in Brighton called GAC captures two paranormal events on CCTV. That's it. The first one happens during business hours in which a white outline walks up the steps and skirts around a customer while they send a text. Sometime later, it walks back up to one of them and then turns around at the last second. If this is a CCTV glitch showing overlapping video, then it's weird how the phantom figure seems to take their positions into account when moving. About two months later, these guitars sway back and forth with no one in the store. None of the other ins- <laughs> You know what I was thinking about? It was like, it was like the spirit wanted it, wanted, wanted to cluck and possess uh, the guy that was texting. But the spirit realized that his man's already clucked and possessed him already. So he was like, oh, damn. Oh, I was ready for you, too. Let me just go ahead to the next human. That, that's, a, that's, what I, that's the vibe I was getting. It's move at all. No shadows on the wall to indicate anyone is nearby. If this is not real, then how was it done? Number 11. Ken Hiron and his ghost investigating assistant Gary explore an old burned down house covered in soot and ash. Trash litters the inside and every surface feels sharp and broken so they can't stay for long. As they are leaving, Ken gets the feeling that they are being watched, a feeling that Gary soon confirms. Something um, behind me. I'm scared. There is something. Sure enough, this figure is observing them from the very corner of the window, barely noticeable if not for its single glowing white eye. They look to be crouched down to make themselves even harder to see. But here's the thing, nobody should be standing in that spot at all. Ken and Gary were just in that house. I don't really see it. That's a portion of the room with a collapsed floor. Number 10. Elliot Mosqueda has a motion sensor cam in his living room that at first glance appears to go off for no reason. Look at the television though to see someone crossing the room. I can see the black reflection of this square poster in the television. So it definitely really was the same background. The question is if it's real or edited. <laughs> Number nine, a father and his two children explore this abandoned house. Wow. It's a strange way to bond. Wow. You son of a bitch. Oh my God. A father and his two kids. He couldn't go alone. He had to bring his kids with him. You don't care about your kids. You don't care about your kids. You don't love your kids. You don't care for your kids. You don't do nothing. Nothing. You, you just, nah. That's crazy. It's almost like you were trying to do some sus things with your kids. Right. And you were trying to like, it, it was almost like you, you wanted them to be gone. He wanted them to be clucked up. Not by you, but by some spirits. Cause why 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 wouldn't you just go alone? You know? I don't know how old your kids are, but I'm pretty sure they can just, you know, watch for themselves. I mean it's two of them. You know what I mean? You could have just left your kids a kids kids at the house by themselves. Or you could have just not went at all. But why would you have to bring your kids? Why would you bring your kids, man? Jesus. It's all about the kids at the end of the day. God damn, 47. I can't respect that. I can't. But I think it might have ended up ripping them apart. They cross into the dark kitchen and immediately hear a wild growl. <laughs> Followed by low whispers and a pair of glowing eyes. They are hurrying out of the house as fast as they can. But debris is everywhere. And they have to move slow. Just when they are about to leave. They find the way blocked by their absolute worst fears. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Get out of here! The thin ghoul is barely reminiscent of a human. Its features wide and dark and taking up large portions of its face. No. Its eyes and nose are missing. I'm good. Its mouth nothing more than a white cavern. You got extending it. Extending from cheek to cheek. Number eight. 
This alleged ghost video was taken on the second floor of a college. Really? But I think it might simply be a chair getting pulled by strain. Yeah. Still, do you see anything here when zoomed in? I can't say I do. Number seven. It's late at night when a YouTuber named Single Athel hears something just outside of his home. His curiosity outweighs his fear, and so he takes a camera outside with him to try and find the source. Wow. At least one person is sure this is a demon, but a lot of people are saying it's just a fox. Let me know what you hear. That's not no fucking fox. That is not no fox. This video was taken in December, which does fall in line with the fox mating season. Still, it's kind of strange that the person living here claims to have never heard this before and doesn't know what it is. Here's another clip to help you analyze the source with me. Lisa, Lisa. Was this a fox or something much worse? Like the rake. Number six, a YouTuber named Melmer4564 has a unique problem with her apartment home, an unwanted visitor who simply won't go away. You might not see it now, but it sees you. <sighs> oh. oh my god. This Holy small crescent shit. shape looks like a human face, oh. no matter what angle you look at it from. Oh my god. Even when the camera is fully tilted, you can still tell that is the left side. Okay, so we'll alright, cool. Just like he said, um, that thing doesn't intend on leaving. Alright, that's cool. You can go ahead and stay here. That's fine. Okay? You can pay the bills. You know, you, you can do whatever you want. Up in here. Up in here. You not gonna leave. But I'm gonna leave. Tonight. Right now. I'm gone. Forget everyone, everything, and I'm out. Never to be seen ever again. Not in this not in this environment, not in this neighborhood. Nope. Hell no. Nah. I'm literally moving on the other side of the country. Just me. So you can go ahead and stay in. Have the time of your life. Not me. One of us got to move. I'm Gail. Yeah, one of us. To, tonight. So you're not going to move. I'm going to go ahead and move. Appreciate you, bro. Face. How did this get here? And more important than that, why is it not going away? Number five, the SEMGHS ghost hunters record some interesting evidence of the paranormal during their investigation of a house in Waterford, Michigan. Nobody is anywhere near the doorway when this motion detector goes off. So tell me how this can happen. This is a new surprise shadow. Oh, the motion went off. Then when he says hello, the motion detector fades away as orbs fall. Hello. Okay, what you are seeing right there, that's the motion detector. And, it's just... and as they are talking about what happened, a third voice chimes in with this creepy whisper. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I was just thinking about, what if somebody made a, uh, a sus detector? Or like a cahoots detector. Oh my god. That would be so awesome and so funny. That's that would be hilarious, bro. And it would be accurate. It'd be dead to the point. It'd be so uh, so spot on. That you have like this device. Right? Say say this is like a uh, a sus detector. You have and it tells you if the person is sus or not in two seconds. Not even that. You'd be like It would make that noise. Woo, 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 woo. Sus. 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 And cahoots. <laughs> and that and the uh, the uh, the sus detector would be a hundred percent right all the time. Holy shit. Plus the uh, oh. it was your standard of the uh, oh. Number four, a YouTuber named D Edge detects strange activity in his hallway after leaving his PS4 camera on record. This small figure appears no less than two times, despite the apartment being empty, at least according to the uploader. 
20 seconds later, the figure makes its second entrance, hanging around the top of the doorway each time before disappearing into the darkness. I was thinking that maybe this was light coming from the window across the room, My but the angle doesn't exactly match up. Something is definitely there, but let me know what you think it could be. That robot Number threw me three. off. This video of a girl brushing her teeth is said to have been found behind a dumpster. Oh my god. By worker taking a break. Deep voices on the tape sound like they must have been slowed down. But her toothbrush sounds normal. So I don't know what's going on here at all. Why is there a video of somebody just brushing their teeth? After 14 seconds of this, movement is heard off camera. And she is ambushed by something that sounds not of this world. <laughs> I get the impression that she was not aware that she was being recorded because she never looks at the camera. Maybe it was even taken on the other side of a one-way mirror. It looks like she's looking directly at the camera. Wall. Number two. This grainy cell phone video comes from the SNDT Women's University in Mumbai, India. They are walking down a long hall filled with various classroom conversations when they see another student coming the opposite way. Well, I guess they didn't technically see them, since it was only a pair of shoes with nobody attached. Oh my god! Like, am I losing my mind? Or if this really is a ghost student going to class before we get to number one. What class you going to, huh? What class you going to? Let me know that, so I know not to go to that class. Better yet, I'm going to go ahead and uh, transfer to a different school, a different neighborhood, in a whole different state, just... To be honest. Cause that mother clucker looked like based off how fast the shoes is running, looked like he was mad, he was mad late to the class. Like, bruh, what's what's up? Huh? Let me know, let me know what's what uh what class you going to. So I'm gonna so I can just stop. That's ridiculous. My name is Chills, and if you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at Dylan is Chillin' YT and tap that follow button to find out. I recently released the number 15 mixtape, but I don't think you should follow these instructions to check it out. It's a proven fact that generosity makes you a happier person, so if you're generous enough to hit the subscribe button and the bell beside it, then thank you. Also, don't forget I upload a new video here on YouTube every Thursday and Saturday. Number one, a redditor named Stalker the Zone seems like he is in a real hurry as he records a wheelchair at the hospital. He is definitely waiting for something to happen, but I get the feeling he doesn't want to get caught by anyone using his phone. So maybe this is his place of work. <laughs> Just when he is about to give up, the wheelchair comes to life and moves on its own. His vindication gives way to horror when he realizes the wheelchair is turning his way. Nope. See? See, I can go. No, 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 I guess someone off screen could be pulling the wheelchair towards them. But my understanding is that wheelchairs are fairly heavy, and any wire that could pull it would also be thick enough to see on video. These scary videos will drop your jaw, and after you've seen what I've seen, you'll know why there's no going back. See, this is my thing. Right, when, 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 when you know it's something paranormal going on, and you whip out your camera, and you start recording, right, or you know something paranormal going on, and, but you're not entirely sure, like, you're pretty sure, but you're not 100%, so you whip out your camera, or you just stay there until something happens, and then when it does happen, you like, oh, let me go ahead and get the hell out, no, no, you know, it was, you waited, you wanted something to happen, you waited, that doesn't make any sense, why would you, you're contradicting yourself. Right? Contradicting? Yeah. You're contradicting yourself. Okay? So, stop. That, that, I don't, I don't know why you would do, I don't know why, I don't know why you, I don't know why you would run, excuse me, when you waited so long for something, excuse me, for something paranormal to happen. That doesn't make any sense. That's like, 
That's like me wanting to cluck this girl, right? Bad as bad as hell, right? 10 out of 10, right? And she finally come over to my place. I'm ready. She ready. I sent, right before I put it in, I'm like, I'm not ready yet. Really? You, you, you. <sighs> okay. That's that's why you're still a virgin. Um, but on on some serious stuff, on the real number, what was it with the stepdad? Number 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 fourteen. Jesus. Oh my God. That was kind of hard to watch, even. Before, what did she? What did he say she was on? She's in the middle of lip syncing a Japanese song for the viewers watching her Twitch stream. Oh, he did say Twitch. I thought he said that other social media. I cannot think of it right now. Jesus, um, that was so hard to watch, even before the stepdad came in, cause she's young as hell. Why is she? She needs supervision, to be honest with you. And then her dressing up like that does not help her look any older whatsoever. And them stuffed animals. And I bet you, bruh, I bet you she has so many, like, men and women, grown-ass people that just watches her. Oh my God, that's so disturbing. And then I put a cherry on top. Her stepdad comes in with nothing but drawers on. Come on, man. Jesus. Mm -mm. That's not cool. That's not cool. This is not, that's not cool. And it's, and it's really clucked up because I know for a fact that there's people in real life situations where their stepdad or stepmom you know be doing some things that's questionable that's sus god that was hard to look at um yeah I feel like there should be like strong parental guidance and parental par, parental parental uh, like attention and supervision when anybody that's underage uh, is on any type of social media whatsoever because there's creeps there's sus mother cluckers out there there's pedophiles out there there's weirdos out there there's a bunch of different people out there with bad intentions oh god that's yeah but Mm. Oh, number four, the animated robot threw me off completely. I thought, yeah, that threw me off completely. Number three, with the old girl just brushing her teeth. What the hell? And it looked like he said that she wasn't looking at the camera, but it looked like she was looking dead at the camera the whole time. Um, why? Why was that? Why is there a video? Somebody just brushing their teeth. What the hell? Jesus. And like I said before, you're, if you have a dog or any animal, but if you have a dog, uh, your dog is like your biggest sus signal or like your biggest red flag signal. If, if you're dead, if you're dead, if your uh, dog is acting weird, stop. You're just. Don't do it. Don't go after what they what they what they barking at, what they growling at. Don't just just get your dog and just go. Don't ask your questions. Don't ask. Don't 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 do nothing. Just just go. Just go. Just go. Just go. Keep cool. Keep classy. And I love you. Stay happy. My family. <laughs>